the current project I have my students working on is to create their own Weebly. The students will create a Weebly about an ecosystem or a city and discuss ecological problems. So in this video, I'm going to show how to create your own Weebly. So the first thing you have to do is log in. Again, I suggest using your Google uh, username and address. Just log in using Google. And I'm going to click on Add Site. The next thing to do is to choose a theme. The website I'm going to make is going to be about ecology, so I will go and click. I think this one, because it has a nice ecology looking background, I can always change the pictures myself. Uh, you can register for a new do domain, probably going to cost money. Connect to a domain you already own. You probably don't own a domain, but if you want to, you could set it up there. I'm going to use a subdomain of Weebly because it's free. I'm all about free. and Cardinal Biology is already taken and Cardinal HS Biology is not so I'm going to go ahead and go with that this could be my biology website so I'm going to go ahead and change the name And this is going to be my home page. And here I can add a description. I can edit this image and I can select from their images or I can upload an image. I can drag over a map so my students can locate where they're at. I can change the address. And if you go down a number, it zooms out, and if you go up a number, it zooms in. Okay, I can add some photos from the photo gallery. And again, it just takes some playing around with to decide where you want to put it. And again, with the uploading of the images, it's just simple as uh, finding them on your computer.
so that will upload a few moments. I can do a gallery, or I can also, there's another option over here to do it as a slideshow or a single image. You can also add title, text, and a few other options that I'll be showing you here in a moment. 